All right, this is our first of three pins of the crossbred gilts. Uh, all the crossbred gilts in this sale would be Three's Company partnership hogs with uh, uh, Austin and Bree and uh, Mortensen there, uh, Farrington, Michigan. Uh, 88 litter is where we're going to start. She's a shame on me backdrop, Dirty Lovin'. Uh, that shame on me is at Moyers there. We've used him here the past couple seasons. This will be a second crop, done a nice job on those sows. Uh, and then Mother would be a backdrop, Dirty Lovin', actually. Uh, uh, Brody Everhart showed her in 2022, won the last class there at Expo. Uh, it goes back to those Dirty Loving Grandmother sows. And uh, this uh, this Lot 22 guild is one that is very, very styled and dimensional. She's a huge arm kind of a guild that's uh, uh, got a big hind leg and, and one that I think fits the market or breeding kind of setting. Uh, looks like a real generator for me in terms of next generation uh, making those uh, uh, those barras and boars. And I think uh, uh, that one there offers stoutness all the way through in, in a really, really kind of a unique kind of a package shape dimension center body heaviness of structure that guilt's got it all going on there and still angles and everything reads true off both ends of her skeleton a 94-6 is going to be a closing time dirty secret hillbilly bone uh, mother's actually one of the original dirty secrets but have been the last crop of those uh, that we bought from heimer uh, she actually produced the reserve uh, uh, weanling guild at Duncan there a few years ago for us. Uh, done a nice job on making uh, a stout kind of pigs, better to closing time, which ties in kind of a, uh, both the sow families we have up there in Michigan. Uh, and I think uh, a unique kind of a colored gilt, but still in terms of quality, she's one that's uh, uh, very sound, very flexible. It's got a nice look to her. She's mobile. She's square. Got good structure for a, a red Halloween colored kind of a gilt. And I think uh, better days are for her. Uh, breeding guilt, you push her, you take her to heavier weights. I think she'll look that part. Uh, and one that I think has got enough shape, dimension, and muscle to jackpot there. Maybe not me, the most cooperative, but that guilt uh, gets out. She's a, a good-looking kind of a hog that's mobile off both ends of her skeleton. I think an easy feeding kind of a guilt there with a unique color pattern.